Hi and welcome one and all to my new channel, I am the OSG, which stands for the Old School Gamer. I am new to this, so bear with me if I make any mistakes. So today we're going to be playing a little bit of Game of Thrones. It's an old TV show that I'm sure all of you who are watching this today really love, so I really love it too, so I'm going to be playing today. and. Let's jump in, shall we? It's my first time playing. As I've said before, this is my first time playing, so I don't know what to expect. I don't know if you guys have already played this yet, so I don't know what you guys think of the game so far, and neither do I, because I'm just about to start playing, so let's jump right into the action, shall we? I don't know about you guys, but I'm already excited about this. Oh, and just to let you know, I've already put subtitles on, just in case. I may talk over any other dialogue, in case you might miss something. The trout, the trout, the trout in the tower, the wolf of the fish and they all ran away. The trout, he fucked off and I was Don't know about you, but the graphics look pretty sweet. The great Jamie Lannister, Kingslayer, both breaker, brought to his knees by the men of the north. And set free by the women. You'd think he'd done it himself the way he tells it. Lord Forrester's sword won't clean itself, you know. Clean a sword. Nice sword, then. Make sure it's spotless this time. Lord Forrester won't be happy with blood and brains all over it. I'll try. Go on, it's only blood. Yeah, it's only blood. Now that is a proper sword. I'll have one like it myself someday. You? You'll never have a sword like that. I say that as a friend. I mean, if we're being honest. Yeah, don't be an just ass. A oh, don't be an ass, Bowen. <laughs> Apologies, your lordship. I had a hand in it, you know. <laughs> hand in what? Capturing him. He was nowhere near the Kingslayer at the Whispering Wood. He was so drunk, he barely made it out of his tent. Next, he'll tell us he caught Tyrion, too. So what really happened? So what really happened? Someone caught him, I suppose. That's Kenny man here, and they'll say it was them. You captured the Kingslayer. Aye. Well, I had a hand in it. Aye. A hand round his ankle as ten others took him down. <laughs> See? What did I tell you? I brought him to his knees. Lord Forrester. Not before he dragged you halfway across the battlefield on your face. You're questioning <laughs> Norrin's honor. I'm questioning Norrin's story. This grows more far-fetched every time he tells it. Get your liege lord some wine. Go on. It's your job. Okay. Right. Thanks. You're welcome. Thank you, Garrett. I'll do it. Norrin's family has faithfully served House Forrester for centuries. His honor is beyond reproach, and House Tully is forever in his debt. They've never seen a field plowed so well as the day the Kingslayer dragged poor Norrin across the battlefield. <laughs> Fetch your cup. Tonight we celebrate. To Rob Stark, the King in the North! The, the King, King in the North! North! Tomorrow, we march on Casterly Rock, and House Forrester has been given the greatest honor to lead the Young Wolf's army and ride as the vanguard! The gods have favored us. Onward to Casterly Rock! Aye! Death to the Lannisters! Aye! 
winter is coming. Let's hope it waits till this bloody war's over. Winter waits. Yes, my lord. I need you to keep an eye out for Roderick. As his father, I could not be more proud of the man he's become. On a night like this, men find false courage at the bottom of their cups. I'd rather he were here. Yes, my lord. There's also the question, what's to be done with you? It's been on my mind for a while now. Something must be done. What do you mean? You've served House Forrester well for several years now, but I can't expect you to squire forever. How shall I reward your loyalty? What can I offer you? You served me well. To bring honor to House Forrester, my lord. You have more honor than those who were born to it. There were those who had their doubts when your uncle put forth your name as my squire. But you've erased those doubts entirely. It would be an honor to see you riding by Roderick's side in the vanguard tomorrow. Not as a squire, but as the equal of any man who serves House Forrester. It's well deserved, Garrett. Your hard work has paid off. Thank you, my lord. I promise. I won't let you down. That I don't doubt. But for now, keep this between us. We're celebrating tonight. I wouldn't want the other squires to feel discouraged. Yes, my lord. Now go, and find Roderick if you can. I will, my lord. Thank you. Bloody hell. Squire! Fetch us more wine! Can you give me a hand? Come on. Make it up to you. Okay, sure. Yeah, no problem. I have been a squire longer than you. So? I outrank you. You should help me. Much more wine. Scrub my armor. Clean my boots. Just my luck to end up with Norin while you serve the Lord. Let him fetch his own wine for once. You're a squire, you're supposed to do the work. An arrogant prick. It's your job to do the work and stop complaining. You try squire in for Nora and see how much you like it. See, that's why you're lucky. Low expectations. If I'd grown up covered in pig shit, shovel and slop, well, maybe I'd think saddling his horse was the greatest honor in the Seven Kingdoms. I suppose this beats pig farming. But not by much. Just shut your mouth. It's the truth. It's not like I'm making it up. <laughs> All I'm saying is, at this rate we'll never be more than this, which is nothing. The lowest of the low. For all I know, we could be squires for life. All in wine around a fucking wedding. I guess with that attitude... Fucking time. I'm sick of listening to your wine. With that attitude, you'll never be more than this. Easy for you to say. Maybe if my uncle were castled in, I'd feel different. Who my uncle is has nothing to do with it. How much further? Well, it's right over there. Take your time. You lot have drunk your share. Good thing, Lord Walders. In a generous mood. Fucking phrase. Nice night for a wedding. Not often he finds a willing husband for one of his daughters. I don't know about you, but I think something's about to go Don't down. Expect me to carry it for you, Sir Garrett. I'm not sure yet. Just gotten into you. You're acting rather odd. You've had too much wine. I think we need to go back. Back. Now. They're fine. They can wait. No, you don't understand. We need to go. And take the fucking flagon already. What's wrong with him? Something the matter? Owen, we have to go. You go if you're in such a rush. Something's definitely going down. <laughs> but what about? What the hell was that about? Slow down, would you? 
What's the rush? They've got weapons. Who brings fucking weapons to a wedding? We need to find Roderick. He's out there by himself. Me, not me. I didn't do anything. Not again. Thank you. My lord. Find a weapon, quickly. Weapon, weapon. Go, my lord, while there's still time. Move it. We need to get out of there. Come on, come on. Seven hells. You wounded. wounded, my lord. I have suffered worse. While the prey says time to <gasps> Guard this with your life. Return it to Ironrath, where it belongs. I'll try. No time to waste. I'll be damned if I let it fall into the hearts of those traitors. What the phrase you have to go. Welcome. To the I'll try not leave you. I, I won't leave you, you my lord. You can, and you will. My lord, By I... the gods. You will obey me. Tell your uncle. 
tell him. The North Grove must never be lost. The North Grove no must never be lost. Do you understand? You must swear. Tell only your uncle Duncan the future of the house. I swear, my lord. I swear that I will, my lord. Hey, hey. It's those foresters. On your honor, you must do this for your honor. You must do this for your house. Go! Kill those uh. fucking foresters! Foresters! <laughs> 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 We love No. Uh oh. Hope I don't get chased. Well, I don't know about you guys, that was awesome. To say the least. Sorry, cutscene. Best intro I've seen by far. Supposedly the intro was inspired by Da Vinci. I'm not too sure on that though. So, what do you guys think so far? Got to move. Let's look around, see what we can find. There was that pig. There's a pig. Can't do anything with the pig. It's blood here. Let's look at the blood. Blood. Whose could it be? Fresh. Can we see the Try and follow the trail. Oh, is it from this pig? Oh, I see smoke in the distance. What's going on? Come here. See a path here. Oh, look. That's father's car. Something's going on. Lord Bolton better give us fucking titles for this. It may be common, but at least still have his bacon. Do you do anything here? <laughs> Keep moving there. They just killed the pig. Move along, boy. There's nothing for you here. <coughs> Father. I said move on. Unless you want to get fed to the fucking pigs. I recognize you. You're a forester squire. Former Stark bannermen have no claim on land anymore. Or haven't you heard? The Starks are dead. Where'd you get that sword? Not a chance that sword is his. Must have stolen it. 
Out here by himself? Probably a deserter. It's none of your business. None of your fucking business. Oh, the language. We're gonna feed you to the fucking pigs. That sword's too big for you, boy. You can barely pick it up. Get off my land! This is Bolton land now, boy. Lord Bolton is the new Warden of the North. I reckon he'd like a proper lordly sword like that. <laughs> no. No, father, no. I'll have that sword, boy. By my cold dead hands, you will take. Fuck you. And again. Alright. Finish this fucking pig farmer. Pathetic. So is that haircut. The axe, the axe. Farmer, aren't you? Get the axe. <laughs> My sword. <coughs> My leg. Out the way, out the way, out the way. Mercy, please. I beg of you. I, I have a family. They'll never survive without me. I have no quarrel with you. You killed my family. I show no mercy. No, please! Lord Whitehill will see you hang for this. That much I promise. <laughs> Father? Garrett! You survived. Your, your sister. Oh, she hid. I tried to stop them. I'll kill the men who did this. That was gripping. That was awesome. Sorry for the lack of dialogue on my part, actually. I'm just going totally immersed into the gameplay. And I think, guys, I might call that part one. Just gonna pause the game a sec. So, I've been the OSG, and I'm gonna call this part one of I don't know how many more yet, so I'll let you guys know. But I think I may release my videos on a Friday, I guess. Friday, late evening. I don't know yet. Like I said, I'm new to this, so... I need to set a time schedule or something. And I hope you guys have enjoyed that. I know I have, definitely. And I hope to finish the door, the story. The dory? The story. Sorry. Again, I hope you guys have enjoyed that. And I'll see you next week for more. Bye-bye.